guys, it's Kiki, and today I'm going to be doing a plan with me for May 2019. So this month's theme, I decided to do clouds. So without further ado, let's get on with the video. So first, as usual, I started off by doing a square. Then I went in with my thick calligraphy pen and wrote May. Around the box, I went in with both of my blue highlighters and just drew some clouds. Since it looked a little bit simple, on the inside of the box, I decided to draw a paper plane flying through the air. For the monthly spread, I started off by writing May at the very top. And then on top of that, I wrote May in simple calligraphy. For this month, I decided to draw individual boxes for each day. However, if you find this is too time consuming, then you could watch some of my previous videos where I only drew a grid. After I drew out each of the boxes, I went in with my normal pen and just wrote Monday to Sunday in calligraphy. With my coloured pen, I wrote the days of the month in all the boxes. Then for some decoration, I drew some more clouds around the calendar. So for the next page, I decided to do a to-do and notes page. So basically, I did the same thing as I did as last month because I really, really liked the way I did this. So I just wrote to-do and notes with a highlighter. Then I went over it and just wrote to-do and notes. And then I just drew a line across. Next, I took my lighter highlighter and then just did a border around each. Of course, to complete the spread, I decided to draw some clouds. So for the sleep tracker, I decided to do something a little similar to the one I did last month. So basically I just drew a box and then around it I drew the numbers. So before I did another box around the numbers but I decided to make it look more minimalist and decided to just draw one box. Then instead of the boxes I decided to highlight each of the sides. Then in the highlighted sections I wrote the numbers. Then for the title I went in with my thin Fude Touch brush pen and wrote sleep. Then around it I just drew some clouds. Lastly for the weekly spread I wrote May at the very top. Then I wrote the dates next to it. Since last month's was a little bit all over the place, I decided to make mine minimalist this time. So I wrote Monday to Sunday on the left side of the page. Then I wrote the dates in blue next to it. Finally, I separated the page with my highlighter, changing the colors. To separate the to-do and events section, I went in with my grey highlighter and then free-handed the line. So I hope you guys enjoyed. If you guys have any suggestions for what I should do for my June plan with me, please let me know down below. 
Anyways, as always, make sure to subscribe, give this video a thumbs up, and comment down below what video you'd like me to do next. Bye guys, see you next time!